What's up, YouTube? Just wanted to go over a few tricks and tips I do when I build engines or lose small little parts, such as this fucking bar that's supposed to go in here in the ball. What I do is usually take like this little rod out of a handlebar, and you know you gotta cut it at one inch. That's the size of the bucking bar. You just cut it at one inch or 27 millimeters. And I usually, for the ball, I just take out a beach cruiser bearing for the crank. For the crank, not for the handlebar. You know, everything fitting up perfect. The ball, these balls here are eight millimeters. That's the size of the ball that comes in it. So, and they fit in there perfect too. So. And also when you cut it, you know you wanna get like your get like a drill and just put an indent in it so it'll flip fit right on that ball when you put it down in there. Also for like the cases, just so you won't mess up your magneto if you ever blow a seal, you usually put like two slits on it. I'm working on this case re engine right now, so I'm just trying to save myself a lot of trouble. And also, like for the small bevel gear, I cut out a little slat. Because I, I don't like to use their little pulley gear tool. I use this here. Just pop the gear right off. I do the same thing for the sprocket gear, pry it right off. You'll be amazed how like this saves so much time. It will save you a lot of time. Also, mosquitoes. I had just reached a thousand subscribers, so I'm actually thinking about giving one of these case reads away. So somebody. Look at how many I fucked up. One, two, three, four, five, six. This was the last one I built. I was running lean. And um, what happened? My piston seized up. I can't get this wrist pin off. I tried everything. This wrist pin will not come out. It's like it's welded. The, my motor was so hot, I poured water on it. It, it just started sizzling. <laughs> I was like, damn. Thing about it, I'm, I'm not mad at the case. I'm mad because I messed the crank up. No, it was a partially balanced crank. A Zeta crank. Man, this baby here runs. It runs. I'm actually thinking about putting it 56 T sprocket on it. Just to see what it before then go to that 56. Oh, it's gonna pull it. I, I know it'll pull it. But yeah. Alright, YouTube. 